Y'all can hear him. What's good though, man? Talk to me, bro. Yeah, man. I just want to come up here and say, man, I'm fucking with Dame, and I'm glad you're pushing the conversation, man, because it needs to be heard when we're talking about some of these guys on YouTube, you know what I mean, versus sound, and everybody's trying to go for sound like EA is pushing, man. So I just want to say I respect that, dog. Straight up. Thank you so much, bro. I appreciate it, man. I'm just, bro, look, I'm just doing what, I'm just speaking on stuff that I've experienced and stuff I know, stuff I feel, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is effortless to me, bro. Like, I'm only staying in my lane, literally. And I want to say this to the chat, man. I mean, I ain't want to say this shit, man, but I'm going to say this shit, man, because I got to give you your flowers right off grip. Shout out to my homie, my brother, uh, Michael Casey, off La Brea, who used to fade me up, right? I don't know if you remember this guy. You know him? Down at the bottom? Right. Well, let me say this. I was in the barbershop getting faded up, and while I was going to L.A. film school and struggling with my beats, because he asked me, he sent me to Dame's Elite Producers courses, homie. And I took your courses. Here, you. I don't. I don't want you to think I'm up here bullshit. I ain't like the rest of these motherfuckers, dog. What? You see this date? Elite producer courses. This was back in August 29th, 2018. I took your courses, and after I finished your course, I sold my first ten. Uh, my first ten pack beat for five racks. So I told if I ever run into you again, I was gonna give you your flowers. And that's why I'm supportive of your channel, yo. Straight up. And that was brought to me by Michael Casey, my nigga. You serious, bro? Serious. Swear to God on everything. Oh man, why you tell me that, bro? Damn. It is, man. That's love, bro. Man, I see that's that's crazy, bro. Damn. So you know, bro, you know that project that was a so I had partnered with this German company. And his German company, that project literally lasted for like five or six months, man. And like that company, that that company literally took like they took like 90% of the money from that, from that. Yeah, I got I got did dirty, bro. They gave me a lot of upfront money. And then on the back end, they um took majority percentage of it, that whole elite producer course thing and then they marketed it to all of these countries and then they was they wouldn't even showing me the um they wouldn't even show me the books so they wasn't even telling me how much money they was putting out but people was was having so many errors with the login and stuff and so i was like nah I take my name off of this and then we ended the project like 20 2018 to like towards the end of it man so that's crazy that like because I, ha I have a producer who started off taking those courses i had nothing to do with that by the way i literally mm -hmm. sat in the room for like three months and filmed content and then they took it, packaged it, marketed it, made all the socials for it, and made a gang of money. And I don't even know how much money they made off of it. But I had a couple producers who ended up flying out to my camps, and they found me from those those courses. So yeah. shout out to them courses, man. They did me justice, yo. That's love, bro. Man, thank, up. thank you, bro. I appreciate you coming up, man. I appreciate it, man. Keep doing, hey, keep doing your thing, yo. We here, yes, sir. All right, man. Stay up, bro. Right. That's love right there, man. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Damn, man. That project was damn, bro. Like this, man. I had did, <clears throat> I had did my biggest producer camp in August twenty seven, no April twenty seventeen. And this German company hit me up on Instagram. This German company hit me up on Instagram and <clears throat> told me they wanted some music for a YouTube channel. So they was paying me like seven seven racks a month. To just make music for a youtube channel they was like yo we started this guitar program in germany we made a million we started this fitness program in germany we made two million we did a guitar program in germany we did almost a million so if we did a million off piano and a million off of almost a million off of guitar imagine how much million we can make 2.4 million off of the whole music industry and we want you to be our guy and we saw monster sessions so we want you to pretty much like give us our own so I was like, all right, cool. But I was just started monster sessions. Like I had just moved into this office August 2017. And by September 2017, they was like, we don't want you to do no more monster session classes. So I was like, what you mean? They was like, we don't want you to do more classes. They was like, how much will, will we will we uh, would you want us to pay you 
to stop doing monster session classes and do a project with us that's kind of like monster but a different name so i said give me fourteen thousand. so they said all right bet so they gave me fourteen thousand a month to stop doing monster session class i wasn't making a lot of money off monster sessions at the time so it was like i'm struggling with monster session courses making maybe like eight nine hundred dollars per camp so like all these camps i was making eight nine hundred bucks they were selling out but the camps were so expensive that i wasn't making money off of them but i was like well i'm raising like i'm raising the interest in them and so after we did our biggest camp we had we had 19 producers come out from three three countries like eight nine states you know what i'm saying we had uh my man san diego come from colombia we had somebody come from canada had somebody come from the netherlands and we had people come from nine states and then right after that a few months later they paid me to not do no more classes so if you was following monster sessions back then we didn't do no more classes until like the end of like 2018 you know what i'm saying it was like almost over a year we didn't do no classes that's because that company was paying me it was like well we'll pay you but we just want you to film for our concert like we need 150 videos on the music industry so i was talking about logic i had to learn how to use fl i had to learn how to use fl ableton and logic pro no fl ableton and um i already knew how to load logic so i had to do videos on pro tools logic ableton and fl so i had to learn how to use fl and ableton in two weeks so I learned those and then I had to literally turn around and teach them. I had to turn around and make beats in them and stuff. So then it was like, well, we can't just do logic. We got to also do the FL is the biggest community. So I'm in there doing 40 videos for FL, 30 videos for Ableton. And then they cut up all the videos and then package them up and then market them to like India and South America. And I, I didn't even know they launched the project. I had no idea they launched the project. I didn't even know it was out. And I started getting all these kids from India messaging me like, hey, my login don't work. And I'm like, what the fuck, you so much your login. I'm like, what login are you talking about? It's like my login. They sending me screenshots from this program on my face on it. And I'm like, what? Whoa. Hell no. Like, so now I'm like, yo, y'all put the project out. Oh, yeah. Why y'all ain't tell me? Oh, um, how much y'all bringing? Oh, oh. So I reached out my lawyer. It was like, well, if you are part of the contract, they have to show you the books. So I'm like, send me the books. They sending me screenshots from a, a, a online marketplace. You know what I'm saying? They making twenty five thousand dollars a month off this product. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, bro. Like in, in this, like Ko, y'all see Ko three three five. Y'all see him all the time. He came from that program. So Ko three three five came from that program. You know what I mean? Like, so it's pretty crazy, man. Shout out to my man. Um. Shout out to my man SAD, bro. That's that, that, that that's crazy, bro. And then the crazy part is, is I don't even know if they were still selling them after. Um, I don't even know if they were still selling them, bro. I made them take the website down. I made them take all that stuff down, bro. Yup, yup. 